Hello everyone, I hope you are doing well. Today's video is going to be another single book review chatting about The Trees by Percival Everett. This was published in 2021. I don't have it with me because I listened to it as an audiobook. Um, and it's such an interesting mix of genres and concepts. And yeah, let's get into it. The Trees is set in Mississippi in a town called Money where very unusual crimes, uh, murders specifically, have been occurring. <laughs> Diego's drinking water. There are a ton of different characters in this book um, from the sheriff and the investigators to the mortician and the reverend and the um, waitress at the restaurant to um, outside cops, the Mississippi Bureau of Investigations, um, to people who come in and, and everything. So there are tons of characters in this story and we see different glimpses from different people. Now Luna is drinking water. <laughs> the event, the crime that has brought so much attention to this town is the murders of all white men who are found with the body of a black man. Um, and what's even more unusual is this same corpse is appearing at each of the murders. This is a political commentary, it is satirical, it is a interesting mix of time period. Sometimes it reads as if it's set in the 1920s. Um, one of the characters included is Caroline Bryant, who only recently passed away, um, who was the woman who accused Emmett Till of making inappropriate comments at her and led to his lynching. Um, so this book does deal with historical events and contemporary events. The author is quite prolific, um, however I've never read anything by him before and I think after this I will absolutely do so. There are laugh out loud funny moments in this book. Um, there are caricatures of just absolutely ridiculous people including KKK members. Um, it's, it's a very creative and entertaining book as well as being disturbing and horrifying. I thoroughly recommend it if you enjoy political commentary mixed with a little bit of crime and potential magical realism. Um, it was a very, very interesting book and I think I could revisit reading it um, in the physical copy in the future because I am sure that there were some things that I missed. Um, it is so fast paced and yes, very, very poignant and very impactful. Thank you so much for watching. Please let me know if you've read anything by this author that I should try reading next. Um, I hope you enjoyed and see you soon. Bye.